uh, with a very fine run this morning. In fact, we would have we would have had the results from this morning, which would be outside. Uh, Sonique Walker is going to be tough for her, but uh, she is capable of doing far better than she did in uh, the opening round zero under starter's orders. They're off. And indeed it is the young lady from Jamaica, Stacey Ann Williams. She is breaking the stagger. She has taken the lead. She has taken the clear lead right now. She is indeed pulling Crawford along. Crawford in contention right now. But it is all Stacey Ann Williams. Doesn't look as though the challenge from Crawford is going to be sufficient. Stacey Ann Williams looks as though she will run away with this one in a decent time as well. Crawford pushing her all the way to the finish line, but the flash time 54.00 seconds and Stacey Ann Williams was never going to be beat be beaten in this one. Well, I think she felt that she was threatened there by Crawford, but uh, she kept her poise and kept her, her composure very well. Let's look just at the final stages of the race here. Her arms a little bit dangling, but uh, Williams kept her poise and kept her form very well and ran through. Not surprising that she's won this one, but it was nice to see Crawford really pushing yes, her and yes. pushing her right to the limit. Very That's much very so. good. In fact, Crawford should have run, as I said, uh, as I suggested earlier, a faster time than she did in, uh, in, in uh, the first round. Uh, as we'll see the flash times coming up just around 54.16 in fact so yes uh, an improvement on what she ran earlier Bahamas uh, getting cleared through Brittany Fountain uh, Brittany Fountain